before the schools go back, if you've got a 16 or 17 year old, there are opportunities to go and get vaccinated just by turning up. Andrew Sharp is from Health Watch West Berkshire. Morning, Andrew. Good morning, Andrew. How are you? Yeah, great, thanks. If people do want to do this and they're thinking, well, before I go back to school, let's give myself the best chance of not catching coronavirus. If you are 16 or 17, where would you go? Uh, so they, uh, they've they opened up uh, both a walk-in and a book-in centre at the Northcroft Leisure Centre in Newbury. Um, so you can go and, and book a place there so you know you'll be seen quite quickly. Or you can just walk in. That starts this morning and runs to the 4th of September. So uh, they're hoping to get the bulk of the 16 and 17 year olds from West Berkshire. And then, of course, the other important thing we're doing is we're out every single day with a community testing van all across West Berkshire, because one of the things that everyone can do as the schools go back is, is find time to test. People have got to start putting this into their weekly schedule that as people start going about their normal lives, they've got to remember that even if you're double jabbed, you can still pass the virus on even though you're asymptomatic. And, of course, what we've got to think about here is all the people who could be compromised still. So although it might not affect young people or stuff like that, if they pass it on to someone who's immunocompromised, who may not have had their second jab or any jabs, or you know, they can still get very, very ill and, and with dire consequences. So testing over the next month or so really needs to become part of everyone's everyday weekly thing test twice a week uh the van is out across berkshire uh so we're in northbrook street today outside the globe we're at falkland cricket club on sunday for the family cricket cricket event and if if people look on the health watch west box website from uh tomorrow you'll find the complete program and not only are they giving out test kits those people who don't really know how to do it they'll actually show you how to do it but we especially especially want the communities who are hardest hit from coronavirus so uh the the, the 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 ethnic minority communities who may not have taken up the vaccine or things like the quite as much um uh, the, the the disabled um people rough sleeping etc etc so we're going to be out talking to all the voluntary sector organizations who work with the uh, seldom heard communities to make sure they get tested as well so that the whole community um is as protected as possible and people can do something you often feel really helpless with coronavirus it's only the you know the scientists and the uh, and the medics who can do anything actually if people test themselves they immediately know if you've been to an event or if you've got friends coming that i'm I, i'm clear um if, if you do this twice a week yeah, so do that yeah okay so testing and um the opportunity to go and get uh, a vaccination if you're 16 or 17 northcroft leisure center one venue uh, worth being aware of thank you very much indeed Anne.